Dear brothers from planet Earth. I am El Moria. Today we will start another lap of the Kamen Hada Dos Reos, which we are calling the journey of forgiveness. So just see yourself starting, entering through a door into a blue room, as explained previously. The blue ray is the ray of creation, the ray of beginning, of transformation into something new. So this stage of the journey has the same purpose as the previous one, forgiveness. It doesn't matter if asked, it doesn't matter if donated. Everything that has already been said will be maintained. Don't let the ego take over your mind. Don't think that when you don't see anything, you are incapable, you are not worthy, you are not ready, and not much less that they don't need to see anything. Each of you is being cared for and enveloped with our energy. And there will be the right moment, the right radius, for you to see what needs to be seen. Their souls are being cleansed. The accumulated energies that do not interfere with the walk are being cleaned. This is the biggest result you will have on this entire journey. So never think of yourself as better or worse than others. Each person will have an answer during meditation. So why compare with anyone else? Why judge others as better or worse than you, for what? So learn, each of you, to live your own journey. It doesn't matter to others whether you saw it or didn't see it. This is your moment, it doesn't need to be posted for everyone to know. Many act like this, out of ego. It is an extremely dominant ego, which always sees fit to show itself to others. And of course, always adding a few more points to what actually happened. So each one stays for himself, if you saw it, you didn't see it, what you saw what you didn't see, it doesn't matter to others, the journey is yours, it doesn't need to be shared with anyone. So just learn to accept what will come, without judgment, without thinking too much about why yes or why not. Everything will happen at the right time. And we all know exactly when you are led into your own shadows. So continue the walk isolated. Yes, you can give each other strength but no one has to comment on what happens with your journey. For what? Every time you comment, you generate all kinds of energy to the people around you. Some react with happiness, others react with sarcasm, others react with envy, so why show off, why comment? Think hard about it. Why do you need to comment so much? Why do you need to be so exposed all the time? The journey is individual, so it cannot be compared to anyone else's journey, it is yours, exclusively yours. So whether you saw it or didn't see it is inherent to your journey, not the other person's. Learn to live your own experiences. Didn't you understand? It's not the other person you have to ask, it's us. Stop thinking that the other is always smarter, that the other is wiser that the other understands everything. It will be. Will he be ready to give you the answer you expect or want to hear? I tell you no, he will give the answer from his perspective, not yours. So if you have any questions, you should ask us. Stop thinking that others are the basis of your journey, because they are not. Each of you has a path to follow, don't expect there to be others around you, the walk is yours. So I hope that on this new journey, on this new return, you become more intimate with yourselves. Look inside yourself, and feel, realize what the walk is bringing. What changes is it causing in you? What paths are being opened? What clarifications are being made? What truths are coming to light? Be alert all the time, because you are immersed in each ray 24 hours it works on you 24 hours a day. So no one goes unpunished, no one goes without a transformation. So just be ready. Be ready for this new round of the journey of forgiveness.